All right, hey guys, so it's time to get some fish in this aquarium. It looks a little bit dirty right now because I just dumped some bacteria supplement in it. But I went ahead, like I said, dumped some bacteria supplement in. It's been running for a little bit. Our live plants are looking great. And it's time to go pick out some guppies and some shrimp. Let's go. So you may have expected me to be at a fish store, but I am in fact not. I am at my breeding for profit tank, which is basically my guppy breeding tank. And there's a few guppies that I really like the colors of in here and I kind of want to showcase on their own. So I'm going to go ahead and pick three of my favorite guppies out of this tank to display in that fish bowl, as well as some cherry shrimp, probably about five of them, just to act as kind of a cleanup crew, just to kind of do their thing in the bowl. So I have my little cup right here. I'm just going to go ahead and scoop out my favorite shrimp and guppies. So I went ahead and transferred them from that cup into this bag just to acclimate them. I have three male guppies in here as well as five cherry shrimp. Just going to go ahead and stick them in here for acclimation. Their tank water is pretty much the exact same as this bowl water. I took it with my little temperature thing, but I'm still going to do this just in case, just to be 100% sure. So they're going to sit in here for about five minutes and then I'm going to let them go. Our plants already have adapted to the LED light great. I really think this is going to be a thriving little fishbowl, even though you can't really call this a fishbowl because it has lighting, it has filtration. If it was necessary, I could add a heater, but it still has a nice fishbowl design. But anyway, I'll be back when we're going to release the fish. All right, we're ready to go ahead and dump them in. As I mentioned earlier, I already added the uh, dechlor I added when I set it up. And then the plants have been in there cycling with it. And then I also went ahead and added some bacteria supplement just to go ahead and jumpstart that cycle. I have had a lot of people telling me that bacteria supplement does not work. But for probably the 500th time, the top fin bacteria stuff, I have used it in basically every tank I've set, it, I've set up. And it's worked 100% great for me. So I really trust it. It's a little bit expensive, but it's really not that big of a deal. Now I'm just going to go ahead, I've opened it up, and I'm just going to go ahead and dump these guys quickly into the bowl just to make sure that no shrimp or guppies get stuck in the bag. So everything is out of the bag. Yep, we're good. So all the fish and guppies are in there. As you can see, they're swimming around already. I'll go ahead and let them get used to their new tank, color back up, and I'll show you them. You can check them all out. So it's a few hours later and they've settled into their home nicely. As you can see, they like swimming in lots of circles, which is pretty much what they're going to be doing in this tank. The cherry shrimp are doing really awesome. As you can see, there's two of them. But I think that's going to be pretty much it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Goodbye.